Hello everyone, hope you're doing well, and in this video I thought I would test out the digital anometer from eBay, so basically a wind measurement, and I was waiting for a windy day, and today we have a windy day, so I'll go ahead and try this out. Um, thanks for watching, hope you're doing well. So, turn it on by holding the, get out of the sun here, turn it on by holding the mode button for two seconds. There we are, and I have it in the miles per an hour. And so right now it's saying 10 miles per an hour from this direction. And let me go ahead and get over here. So let's see if we can get, saying two miles per hour right now. 4.5. I'm not sure how much I really trust this thing. Um, as you can see the numbers here, they just, it feels a lot more windy than the numbers are showing because if I just blow into it, I can get it to go 10 miles per hour from just blowing into it. So I would say this is a, a really a meh product. It probably needs to have a bigger spinner. Um, it's, it's not as bad as the uh, tachyometer I got from China on eBay, but um, I don't know if it's really any that good. So I'll just use it for fun, but I mean, I really don't think it's that useful. Especially if there's a slight wind, it can't pick it up. So it has to be even a heavy wind like this before it can even measure wind, which for flying quadcopters, you want to be able to um, see a slight wind. Um, yeah, so it's kind of a, it was a test, and it's kind of a not very good. Thanks for watching, hope this helps.